Do you know that you can remotely access and use someone else's computer, helping them in real time as if you are right there in front of their screen? Yes, you can control their PC from miles away. In this video, I will show you exactly how you can do that using the AnyDex software. So stay tuned. So in order for you to access someone's computer from anywhere that you are, you need to download this software. We call it AnyDex. And if you don't have it installed, just open up your browser and I'll just search for download AnyDex. Now when you click on it, the first link that comes, just click on remote desktop software for Windows. So just tap on it. Then over here, you can just simply download the AnyDex software and then install on your computer. Now I've already installed the AnyDex. So how do you connect to someone's computer remotely and help or assist the person? This can be your friend or maybe a family member who is finding some challenges on their computer and then you want to log in from wherever that you are in the world and assist the person on their computer using the amount's keyboard as if you are just sitting right in front of their pc so let's see how to go about it so you have to open up the anydex software now when you open up the anydex software you will need an id or address from your friend or the person that you want to assist so any when you open the anydex anydex generates an address for you so currently this is the address on my computer so if i want an assistant from a friend or maybe i need someone to help me i'll just give the person this address so here we want to log on to someone's computer so we will need the address from the friend or the person that we want to assist and then you just enter it here so i'm just going to put in the address of the computer that i want to connect remotely to all right so here after entering the address i'll hit on the connect now when you say connect probably a need to connect to the remote computer so we just wait for it so make sure that you have internet connection you need internet to do that so here the person need to accept or allow the authentication so that i will take over their machine now one thing is that you you can also set a password or if the person have set a password you will need a password from that person i'll show you later how to do or set a password so let me put in the password of that computer so that may be from your friend or maybe if the person hasn't put any password he have to accept from the other computer so let's let me put in the password all right so if i click on ok then automatically i've been able to log on to the computer of that person so this is the person's desktop um, let me minimize it then you can see the difference so this is my desktop and this is the desktop of the person so i'm right now on the person's pc so what i can do is that i can just minimize it and then you can see i'm using the person's computer so this is the person's desktop i can access anything if i want to open an application i can open an application and assist him or her on whatever that they want to do now you can even transfer files from your computer to the person's computer if you want to transfer files you then you have to go to the browse file so here you can transfer files so this is currently my computer this is the device and this is the remote device actually it's my laptop that i'm using so it's on the other side so if i want to transfer a file i can just select the file here and now from there i will just say upload so the moment i say upload it's going to move it from my computer to the remote device now one thing about these remote desktop application is that they even have a mobile version so in case you want to what connect using the mobile version i will show you how to do that so currently this is how you can connect using the anydex software so currently this is the remote computer here so you can see it i can even open any application that i want let me just go to the start menu of that computer yes yeah, so you can see i have been able to access any software from here so let me just say i want to open um adobe animate so i am just sitting somewhere and remotely i've been able to log in 
to that person's computer so anytime maybe a friend needs a help or need an assistant you can use this nadex to do that so currently that is how it is so if you, if i want to also create a password on my nadex so that the person can also connect without needing any approval from me you can just go here and then you come to set password and i can set a password so if i set a password here that means anywhere that i am in the world i can connect to this computer by providing the password but if you don't have a password then you may need an approval on the other machine so anytime that you are connecting to your friend your friend will need to accept you all right so that is how the nadex works if you want to just close the connection you can just cancel it here and automatically it has logged me off so this is the remote computer which i can log in and access so feel free and then go ahead let me hear from you in the comment section and don't forget to share this video to help others as well